Hi there, I'm Tony and welcome to Tech TV 101 News. This week at the Game Developers Conference, a new service was announced called OnLive. Essentially what the service does is stream the games in a video-like feed to PC, Mac or TV. To stream to the TV you'll need what OnLive is calling a micro console. OnLive has been in development for now the past seven years and has been headed up by the former IDOS CEO and the founder of Web TV. I'm sure we'll be hearing a lot more of OnLive over the coming months and the run up to its launch at the end of the year. Also announced was the latest in the Call of Duty series. This time they've decided to drop the Call of Duty tag and just go with Modern Warfare 2. Not much is known about it just yet other than it will be out in November. I can't wait to see some gameplay footage of this and I'm sure we'll be seeing and hearing a lot more of Modern Warfare 2 during E3 this year. Canon has announced that they're launching the follow-up to the 5D Mark II, the 500D. This will be a 15.1 megapixel camera with full 1080p HD video recording. If the shots and video footage that the 5D were able to produce are anything to go by, this new 500D will be nothing less than amazing. The camera also boasts the ability to take shots up to 128,000 ISO, so shooting in the lowest light conditions should be possible and not too noisy with that new Digic processor. It's due out May and we'll have a full review as soon as we get our hands on one. Google recently updated YouTube with a host of new features, including an upload progress bar. This is a feature that should have been there from day one if you ask me, but I'm glad it's eventually been added. Don't forget if you have any news you'd like us to report on, you can contact us on the email address here or on Facebook or in the forums. See you next time.